Hey guys, it's Nicole. So this is essentially part two to let's make a masterboard video that I did earlier today. Um, this is my finished masterboard. It is all dry now and it's a little busier than I normally do. I'll be the first to admit that, but I'm going to cut it up now and turn it into some ATCs. I always trim the edges of my work first before I um, cut them into ATCs and such. It's just always what I've done. I like a nice clean edge. Sometimes the paper goes over the edge a little bit and I don't like it. I mean, I don't mind it while I'm, I'm creating, but after I'm creating, I want a nice clean edge, which I'm sure most of us do. Okay. Ooh, that must have been a glob of paint right there. Oh, and what do you know? Some of it wasn't dry yet. Whoopsie. We'll just wipe this off. A little bit of glitter there. From the stickles. Oh, well. It was just a little tiny piece, so we're okay. Alright, and of course... My stupid trimmer shredded some of the paper on the side here. I have new blades coming tomorrow. Okay, so let's cut this up into, so an ATC is two and a half by three and a half. So start here by cutting this into two and a half inch pieces. This one I will do. Oh, I found the wet piece. Just got a little bit on my hand. It's just a little bit of stickles. Most of it's dry, so we're okay. And this one I think I'll do. Is it enough for three and a half? Nope. Okay, so this will be two and a half as well. Okay, and then I'll save this for a future project. Don't know for what. Okay, so then we will cut this down to, I really like this top side. So I can go down here so you guys can see so I'm gonna cut this at three and a half there we go and do I want to cut it here or do I want the other side what would it look like if I cut it here at three and a half no I think I like this side better okay so let's do this and you can save these for little inches or another project. Okay, so we have two. Let's cut this one, three and a half. And I want to cut a little bit off of here. The paper didn't cut real well when I did it upside down. So we'll cut that and let's go I think what I'm going to do is cut a little bit here and then let's see how much, let's cut a little bit here. This is where it's kind of wet so probably getting stickles all over everything. Okay, let's see here if I put this at three and a half, how much would it give me? Oh yeah, I like that. Okay, so there's another one. Um, this whole page isn't, or this whole sheet right here isn't my favorite. Okay, I'm going to cut this because it's a little ragged. And three and a half. And let's see what three and a half would give me here. Yeah, it's a good mix. Or do I want to flip it? Nope, I like that. Three and a half. And I can save this. Okay, I'm going to cut a little bit off of here because there's just kind of boring, nothing really going on there. 
Let's make this three and a half. How many times can I say three and a half? A lot, obviously. Here we go. And then here, ooh, I like this whole piece. Let's see. There we go. Okay. So let's take a look at our finished ATCs. Ooh. Okay, so we have this one. This one, and you can leave these as is because each one is a little piece of art, or you can add images to them, or words, or images and words, whatever you want to do. Here we go. So you can add things like, um, let's take this off now. Oops, look at all this paper I'm finding everywhere. So what happens when you glue all the time and collage, there's just paper everywhere. Okay. Here are all of our ATCs before we've added anything to them. And I think they look really cool. I really like them. And then you can add things like, I have um, some black and white images here. So you could add things like, let's see here. You know, you could add a black and white image to it, to the color there. Hold on, I'm blocking the light. Hold on, just a minute. There we go. Okay. So you can add that, how cool that looks on there. Oh, I got these cute little kissing kids. Ooh, I like her. Look at her. Okay, so let's add her to something. Do I want to add her? Yeah, she's cool. I like her a lot. Okay, I think I'm going to add her to that page. I have a piece of cardstock here I'm going to use to glue on. Oh, I love this one. This one's probably one of my favorite ones. This ATC. It's getting her really stuck down there. And then I like to ink my edges. Oh, you know what though? First, where is, hold on one second guys, hold on, bear with me, got an avalanche going, where's my, where's my stamp, oh there it is, all the way in the back, of course, of course, okay. back of this I'm going to add the date which is oops July you go back to zero and today's the fourth I mean not July August when we I was like wait it's the fourth of July <laughs> Wow okay so I'm just gonna is this the front top okay yeah I'm just going to put the date there. Okay. Now, let's ink the edges. We 
because I like to do that. It's my signature touch. There's one down. I like it. I could add some words, but I'm not going to because I really like the art that's on here, so I don't want to take away from that. Okay, what else did I cut out the other day that I like? Ooh, what's this guy doing? He's like, oh, me amor. But I love you so much. Mwah, mwah, mwah. I don't think I want to use him. Ooh, she's pretty. I could use her. I don't know what she's doing with her hands, though. That's kind of weird. Ooh, I like this guy. Let's see. Do this. I'm gonna glue him down. Oops. Who doesn't put a lid on their ink? Ugh. This girl, that's who. Okay. Let's glue him down. Probably not even in frame. Gosh, I love how these look. Just when you think, like, I'm like, oh my gosh, this is just way too busy. But then, when you cut them up, it's totally a different story. I mean, yes, they're still very busy, but I love the way they look when they're cut up. All together, not so much. Cut up, love it. Okay, and just as I put my ink away, I'm going to use it again. I was literally popping a zit on his face as he was driving by. Ew. Like he wasn't even using, okay, forget the fact that he wasn't using any hands to drive in a residential area. I hope he didn't kill any children as he's driving, but he's popping a zit. Like, dude, just wait till you get home or pull over, but not in front of my house because I don't want to see it, which is funny because I love watching zit videos, but not like that. Ew. Okay, so I have this guy. Well, this guy. And I kind of want to add a word. Oh, that's stories. I don't want to. Let's see. This is the Tim Holtz chit chat. There goes my neighbor that drove over her, my curb the other day. Okay, what do I want? I want like handsome or something like that. Let's see, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H. There's no handsome. Hmm. What other word would be good? Oh, maybe on this page. How come we don't have handsome? I want something man. Oh, I have father. I could put father there. He kind of looks like a father. Um. Could put memory because it's old. How about timeless? Because I don't know what year this is from, but it's old. So I'm just going to put timeless. Okay. There we go. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. I'm loving it. All right. You know what? I need a word on her now, too. I need something like wow. <laughs> Look at her face. She's like so shocked. Like, oh, you caught me. 
Um, how about capture, since I just said that? Although, is there something else like... Uh, let's see. What am I thinking of? Something like... Hmm... Secrets, Delight, what did I see before that that I said I was going to use? Shoot, what was it? Oh, Secrets. She kind of looks like a friend just told her a secret and she's like, ah, no way girl. Uh-uh, that did not happen. And you're like, uh-huh girl, yeah it did. Okay, I'm getting out of control. Okay, so there's two. Let's just move these on down the line. And we'll move this down, this over. Okay. What else do I have? <laughs> okay. We already established. I don't really care for those two. Oh, she's too big. What's this little granny? Oh. This is the one I said looked like she had a hook for an arm when I was doing this the other day. I don't like her arm, it's weird. But I do like her, so I'm gonna use her. Thank you, Curly T, for making me cut my little images. Now I'm having fun with them. I owe it all to you. Okay, I feel like just cutting her hand off, it really bothers me. So I think what I'm gonna do is, oops, I need to stamp this one. Okay, come on. Jeez. Shaky. I don't know why. I just ate a bunch of pistachios. I bet my teeth look amazing right now. Okay. While I was watching Caged Fish go live. Man, I love her. I miss her videos. She's been taking a little breaky poo. But there were so many people over there that I knew... She was doing a, a giveaway. I did not win, but some of you did. That was fun to see friends win. I'm jealous of you. I'd love to have done a video on something I won from Carla. That would have been amazing. But I am super happy for all the winners. Okay, I need a word for her because I'm going to cover up her little hook hand. Because I, I, Okay, if you guys want... This is what I'm talking about. See it... Um, Look, I don't know if you can tell, but like she has like this little hook thingy. Bothers me. Okay, so I think I'll do white. Um, she looks um she looks like she's I should do imperfection because Courage, soul, sentimental, treasure. Hmm. Meh. I know those are hitting me. I ordered some snarky words, so I'm excited for those because that's more my style. Determined. She does look determined. Hmm. Genuine. Forevermore. Hmm. Well, let's do, she does look serious. Let's do that. Why are you so serious? I think I'm going to go out, put a little blue on this. Get on there. I need my little tweezers, which are just seriously right to my right, but I'm too lazy to go grab them. And I'm going to cover up her little stinking finger. It grosses me out. It's so weird. Did I put the date? Put the date. I went around the edges. Okay. There we go. La la la. Okay. I'm in a weird mood. Okay. So we have three there. And it's okay to leave some of these just as they are. You know? I want to cover something on this one because this one's not my fave. Oh. Is this a little scientist? I don't want to cover it that much, though. Maybe if I turn it around this way. Hmm. 
kind of feel like that covers it too much. What's this guy? Is he wearing a dress? Oh no, it's his coat. Okay, so maybe I'll put him here. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah. I need to cut out more images out of my book. Takes you 10 hours to cut them out and then two seconds to use them all. Am I right? I'm right. You don't need to respond, I already know I'm right. Okay. Lid on the glue stick. Let's see if there's a sentence that I like for this one. And I think I'll do it in black. Once you go black. Okay, let's see. Travel the world over to find the beautiful. I do like something travel. Um, this guy doesn't seem like leave a little sparkle wherever you go kind of type. And so the adventure begins. Does he have a... Oh, he does have a sword. Um... I should, but be, I'm gonna. <laughs> this one says, so this guy is like using a towel or he's putting something. Oops. Oh, that lady came with it. So it's like he has a sword and it, he's putting a letter on it or wiping probably blood off of it or something. Who knows? So this one says, be open to whatever comes next. <laughs> Could be your a sword to the heart. Could be a love note. No one will ever know. Be open to... Where did that other piece go? You go over here. I don't want you sticking to my... Be open to whatever comes next. Okay. A little stamp -a rooney Bada bing, bada boom. Stamp around the edges. Okay, you know what? I changed my mind. I'm, I'm altering. We're altering some more. We're altering the altered. I've been really into the rounded corners on my ATCs lately. So that's what I'm gonna do. That looks way better to me. I don't know why. It just seems more like together. And this dude. pieces coming out everywhere. Okay, so now I need to re-ink the corners because they're lonely. They need color too. There. 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 Oh my gosh, I love, love black and white images on top of all this color. It just makes it pop. It really does. Okay. So I'm going to end this here. I have four that I've kept normal. Well, <laughs> normal. Okay. There's four that are not altered. And then I have these four that I did alter. I've got that one. The serious lady with the hook that's hidden. The timeless guy. And this lady with her. Oh, secrets. All right. Okay. And just because I feel like it, I'm going to round the corners on these. And I think I might just leave these as. Ooh. Ooh. Come on, go easy on me, guys. Got. My hands hurt. 
I need to empty this. Maybe that's part of the... Oh. They all just fell on my leg. Oh, this thing is killing my hand. It's not even that hard to push either. I just have really bad hands. Okay, that one was. Woo! Now it's a party. Confetti to ATCs. Okay. And I want to go around the edges of those and then I'm going to put the dates on them off camera and then I'm going to put all of these in my ATC binder. I have some people that I've been trading with. So I will probably use these. Maybe I will trade these. We shall see, but I like to have some in my binder that are plain that I can either use for something else or, you know, maybe I want to leave them as is because I like them like this. You don't always have to glue things on them. These are a piece of art in their own right. So I like to keep them like that too. Okay. Perfect, you guys, I love them. Don't these look rad? I think so. I think they're pretty wicked. All right, guys, thank you so much for hanging out with me and seeing how the masterboard looks once you cut it up, which is my favorite part, all-time favorite part, and hanging out with me while I added some of these images on and not images and all that kind of stuff. I had a good time. I hope you did too. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.